My name is uh, Jacopo Yenna. I'm a choreographer, a dancer, and a filmmaker. So my practice is a sort of uh, mixing of uh, dance and visual art. Let's say working on these languages and how I can reflect with these languages in different kind of uh, format. The idea was to really work on a dance piece with this idea of a probabilistic series, a so sort of algorithm. So the reference is a sort of um, evolution, Darwinian evolution, like if something happened, can transform into something else. So I wanted to work with um, different dancers from maybe uh, a street dance background. So to have a vision of dance and how to abstract these different codification of movements and gestures in an ab abstract um, environment where people can really relate with the immediacy of dance, where every gesture erases the next one. And then I decided to work with Caterina Barbieri. She's the musician uh, that created the, the dance. And she really worked in, in this idea of a pattern of music that generate um, a sort of uh, environment, uh, an abstract environment with uh, analogic synthesizer. So this parallel is the base of the, of the piece. In the museum, we can have a different uh, approach of the viewers. Of course, performance has every time and really expand this uh, choreography in terms of action and, uh, and module because this choreography is made of different modules where the dancer can activate during the piece, starting from this undulation because the dancer starts from a really simple undulation. It's like the uh, how our uh, life in the mother belly, so this undulation make a simple movement to generate all the piece. So it's really a, a primitive movement to create all the choreography. And also the light starts from this kind of white to go in this kaleidoscopic uh, view uh, and really try to embrace all the, all the, all the audience too. So it's really a sort of a dialogue between the music, the dance, and the, the ambience we have also in terms of colors, because of course the colors is something that uh, impact on, on us and make a sort of different perception of what we see.